baby. You looking like a chug jug tonight. I wanna chug you up. Hey, what's going on guys, and welcome back to another Monster Hunter World video. Today I'm bringing you guys a spicy spread light bowgun set using the new Zenajiva Gamma armor. That was, that was kind of weird to say. A spicy spread. Anyway, this is an updated version of my old light bowgun set. If you guys have seen that video, you'll know I only really like spread ammo based bowguns, so... Let's get into it. As always, a fair warning, these sets use rare decos and endgame armor pieces because they are endgame sets, so proceed with caution. So first, for the bowgun, we're going to be using the Devil's Madness light bowgun. This is the Devil Joe LBG. The mods I'm going to be using are two recoil suppressors so we don't get stopped while shooting spread 3, and a close range up to boost our spread 3 damage. I also augmented the gun for an affinity augment and an attack increase. For the helmet, we're going to be using the Teostra Gamma Helm, the Kaiser Crown Y, slotted with two tenderizer jewels. The chest piece is the Draken Male Alpha, slotted with a Release Jewel. The gauntlets are the Zenajiva Claws Gamma, slotted with a Tenderizer Jewel, a Mighty Jewel, and an Attack Jewel. The coil is the Zenajiva Spine Gamma, slotted with a Spread Jewel and another Attack Jewel. And the boots are the Zenajiva Spurs Gamma, slotted with a Mighty Jewel and two final Attack Jewels. And finally, the charm we're going to be using is the Awakening Charm 2. As a whole, this would give you four levels of Attack Boost and Critical Eye, maxed out free element slash ammo up, Maxed out critical boost, maxed out weakness exploit, two levels of maximum might, spread shot, one throwaway level of power prolonger, one level of special ammo boost, and most importantly, it gives us the Zenajiva set bonus, spare shot. Despite having one wasted level of power prolonger, this set is far superior to the old one, and I honestly prefer this one to the other variations you can make with this set because you don't have wasted skills like Blight Res. Even though it sounds like a useful skill, unless you can max it out, it's really not worth investing into it that much and there's other ways you can counter different blights from different monsters so I personally don't really like blight res this also has a level of special ammo boost which is great because it improves our wyvern blast and also you now have the ability to have higher levels of crit higher levels of crit boost higher levels of raw damage however since the devil's madness also has dragon ammo which is super strong there is an alternative build to this one Basically, you swap out the helm and chest piece for the Azure Rathalos pieces, and replace all the attack decos for expert jewels for the affinity, and slot in the weakness exploit jewels that you end up missing. Both sets are super strong, so I, I recommend them both. Just use whichever one is better to your liking, and of course, if you're fighting something that's weak to dragon, then you're much better off with the Rathalos set. Best thing is, is that both of these are pretty endgame ready, so you have a decent amount of slots you can replace for defensive skills if you need to, a bunch of level 2 slots you can replace with other skills that you might need for a specific fight and you have optimal dps because even though you have a build that's catered to having the spare shot bonus you still will deal a lot of damage regardless if it procs or not whenever it does proc multiple times in a row that'll just be like a cherry on top basically well guys those are my light bowgun sets uh, i hope you guys like them the Zenajiva gamma armor really brought lmgs to did i just say lmgs lbgs okay light bowguns to a whole new level and of course if you guys have any suggestions by all means let me know in the comment section down below i'll be uploading a set for pc players in the next few days i have not forgotten you computer brethren i'm going to be uploading a starter greatsword build and a starter light bowgun set as well so stay tuned for that also i have been streaming every other day so make sure you're subscribed to be notified of when me and my videos go live and if you enjoyed this video be sure to leave a like it is very much appreciated so thank you guys for watching boys i'll see you in the next one take care